Hello Guardians, welcome back to another Destiny 2 video. Obviously I don't talk about actual proper things in the game and what's going on, I only really do that if something in particular really annoys me. But obviously, uh, we've got this returning now. We've got the monsters versus mechs, or sorry, mechs versus monsters. Now obviously I'm, the I'm on the TWAB itself, so I could get copyright claimed at any moment. I'm sorry, I shouldn't keep joking about that, but Bungie are doing their best on that. They'll have it somewhere anyway, like it's all good. I must say, like at first, I actually thought, oh, that looks, that actually looks really good. Like, look at how cool that looks. And then my reality was shattered when uh, I was re-reminded that we had dinosaur armor and it was similar like that. And this part is actually a part of the helmet. And then even you can see here, like you can only see those teeth and you can't see like bottom teeth sticking out. So unfortunately the monsters will lose, even though like it does look better, it looks detailed. But as people said before, um like they get a lot more detailed once they're finalized and put the game obviously this has been cooking for over a year now so like obviously different concepts like phases have been uh implemented and shown to different people and redid redone touch back up i wouldn't be surprised if like they basically just show us like the in-game models next year if the monsters <laughs> don't win because <laughs> that'll honestly be like hilarious like if anything they could have added the monster pack as a part of like the 30th anniversary thing and just be like yeah there you go just just Take it here now, please. We don't want this concept anymore. We want it out there now for people to use. But yeah, obviously, monsters do look pretty fly. I think I'm a bit biased right now just because they have more detail. But I will admit the mech stuff is kind of cool. Um, a lot of people have been arguing about the asymmet asymmetrical uh, armor. And well, obviously, you can see on the arm here, here. I don't think it's on the monsters. I think the monsters are pretty good. That, I can't think that kind of makes sense. But I'd love to see like spikes there as well. Uh, Cyclops looks kind of cool. That looks pretty even enough as well. It's obviously more like potent here, especially here. But to be fair, that's probably like a bond. That's probably why that's sticking out. So you can kind of like pick and choose that if you want to. Like I'm sure there's like a bond out there that barely takes up any like visible space anyway that you could just be like, oh yeah, no, it's just a rope I put on my like Gundam's like arm anyway, you know? But like, yeah, no, there's just, they're pretty cool. Um... If I was to say right off the bat, just literally based on detail, if if I was told this is how these are exactly going to be in game and this is how plain these were going to be in game, I'd probably say monsters. Weirdly enough, but I feel like the uh, the Gundam suits might be a bit cool, so I don't know. It also depends on how the cloak goes as well. But I think I'm a bit, I'm a tiny bit like indifferent when it comes to this. I say that as I've already said that I kind of prefer the monsters, but like I, I usually stick to like what I already have anyway for armor and stuff, so yeah, I probably won't even buy them when they come back like around in uh, Festival of Lost Time, so yeah. I just thought I'd make this like quick little video just showing this and stuff, yeah. So if I haven't linked the TWAB in the description, please remind me to. Anyway, Guardians, thank you so much for watching this little quick video. Uh, obviously, if you liked it, you can like it if you want. Comment on what you think of, uh, well, which set you think is going to win and what's going to appear and what's going to happen next year. Like, to monsters if they lose again. And subscribe if you want and hit the bell if you do so desire. And see you, Guardians, in another video.